Last time on the Blondies MX-5 World Tour. But they're revving up at the moment, so I'm gonna call the green flag. They all got really good starts. Jan Cummins is getting a run in the black car alongside uh, Jao Freitas in the green and red car. Brown and Thomas, Thomas has spun his car, to his Timo has hit him, and uh, all kinds of action happening right here in the first lap. Ethan. Sam McAleer in 10th uh, place is having a lot of trouble. Looks like he has damage wiggling a lot on the straight. straight and Sam McAleer actually gets very loose, skimming the grass, goes off into the uh, dirt, and looks like he's going to get set really back. Uh, Jan Kuhlmans, mind you now, this is going to be interesting. He's right on the tail of Jao Freitas. Uh, Kuhlmans backed out a little bit there, Ethan, and suddenly uh, Jao Freitas back in the lead again. And Jao Freitas looks like he must have gotten a slowdown because he just let Kuhlmans pass. It looks like Rato actually has the inside, and uh, Richard Eklund is going to give him the position. So Richard Eklund is falling like a rock. So as you can see, who's that going wide there, Ethan? That looks like Jao Freitas it was, and uh, Mura attacks and takes the position from Jao Freitas. So Jao Freitas lost quite a few positions there, Ethan. And Marco Mogren, sorry to cut in there, Marco Mogren attempted to overtake Jim Boland. And uh, they touched, and Jim Boland was turned around. In fact, uh, this long straight gives a lot of draft. Yumi Rato is going very defensive on the inside, and Eklund's actually going to go past. And nice we have Richard following. Eklund has uh, slowed very significant. Did you see what happened there, Eklund? Because he's just lost the place now to Sergio Mura. Yeah, it looks like Richard Eklund's going to have the inside. Rato uh, seems to be pretty safe at the moment. Eklund breaks a little later than Mora and looks like he's got the position. Sergio Mora, uh, first man to pit. He took two tires, so uh, I'm interested to see how this strategy will work. Yeah, and in fact, we actually have Guillermo Rato and Richard Eklund side by side. Richard Eklund's going to try to keep on the outside and actually uh, makes the maneuver and has the second position. Yeah, and I was just looking at Jao Freitas that actually made a move on Guillermo Mirato after passing Arthur Chan. Guillermo Mirato was very slow coming onto the front stretch, and Jao was able to easily get past, and he managed to gain a position as Matthias Swani actually spins right in front of Jao Freitas. Jao Freitas got lucky there not to hit him. Eklund was trying to uh, make it three wide, and uh, he hit uh, Matthew Baker and lost, uh, spun him around. Tomorrow has uh, been back and hit, so uh, it looks that uh, he came in through the S's and uh, missed some of the gates and they went into the tire barrier, so it's uh, from Dennis and it looks like he's out of the race now. Trevor Mack has made a pass on Uros Jelenko and we missed it, unfortunately we missed that one, but good driving from Trevor Mack now into fifth place. Kuhlmann's yes, coming yeah. down the hill for the final time, Ayrton. He's about to take the last right-hander and go across the line for his, I believe it's his 31st or 32nd win of the of this series. Yep, and his third win of the season as he uh, spins around in celebration. Uh, 14 seconds behind was Richard Eklund. Yuri Rato in third. Jao Freitas in fourth. Trevor Mack in fifth. Josh Jalinko in sixth. Tumas Hallam in seventh. Timo Tuliain in great comeback in eighth. Brandon Strohshine in 9th, and Simon, uh, Simon Van Jr. in 10th.